Now, one of the things that happens as we age is our stem cells get pooped out. It's called stem cell exhaustion. It's one of the hallmarks of aging we talked about. And our stem cells age as we age. So their ability to regenerate tissues, cells, repair, heal our bodies kind of declines a little bit. We now can start to use stem cells as a therapy for degenerative conditions, whether it's arthritis or broken down joints. And this is being used in sports medicine for athletes. It's being used in longevity medicine. So it's starting to happen. I think the question is, how do we get more of this? And I think the more research we do on this, the more it becomes acceptable, the more we'll be able to sort of innovate around this. Right now, these stem cells are a little challenging to get because you can't grow your own stem cells and give them to yourselves in America. You have to kind of go to a different country right now It's because of the regulatory environment, but I think that'll change. But I want you to think of your stem cells as sort of the memory of your youth. They have the capacity to renew, to repair, regenerate cells, and they also secrete factors that regulate the immune system, that reduce inflammation, they stimulate healing throughout the body, and they produce these things called exosomes, but these are like little packets of healing factors that contain proteins and peptides and microRNA, all these things that teach your body what to do to repair and heal. 